Hi everyone, welcome to our Casa Sweet Casta. We're having a bit of a quiet morning today, so I thought I'd talk to you about one of my favorite topics, why we homeschool. So my older girls are working away on their independent work and my little toddler is taking an early morning nap. So I thought I'd talk to you about why we homeschool. So uh, to make a kind of long, long story a little bit shorter, um, uh, last uh, fall 2015, uh, my eldest was in fourth grade and my second was in first grade and they were in private school. Um, and so far it had been a good experience at the school, though I had a bit of um, trouble with, not trouble, but concern with the size of the groups and really how much learning they were getting in. And so at this point is where we started to think of something different. It's actually they heard of some other families that, in our handbuilt group that decided to homeschool. And the girls actually brought me the idea that they'd like to consider homeschooling. Um, I told them that I was briefly homeschooled for a while when I was in middle school and they thought it was a good idea. So the main reasons that we decided to homeschool boil down to time. Time for family and time for the interests that they wanted to pursue. Um, the school that they went to it was 20 minutes away and with traffic and everything it took us about an hour to get them to school and get them back and then to do homework and then to study and so a uh, big plus for us homeschooling is time time together uh, our mornings are much less rushed and um, we have a lot of time uh, my husband's um, work sometimes required him to be gone early in the morning and sometimes at night he had meetings so there were days where he was home during the day when they were in school so they didn't get to see him and so uh, because of our family schedule homeschooling is a lot more convenient for us I'm blessed to be a stay-at-home mom I have been so since they were born so it was an alternative for us that I take charge of, of their schooling. And so when they were in school, they always said they wanted to take another instrument. They were already in a handbill choir and that was a bit, a bit of a rush for us. Every, every day we had practice and they wanted to take violin and, and some other instruments. And I always thought, where are we going to get the time? Where are we going to get the time to do these things? And once we decided to homeschool, we, we now have the time to fit that into our schedule to get her uh, comfortably to violin lessons and have time to practice. And so time has always been a very big element in why we decided to homeschool. It's changed our family dynamic to be able to wake up and just make our own schedule and have a relaxed breakfast and then read some scripture and sing together. That has made our family a lot better. And we're very, very grateful for that part of it. And also, like I mentioned, time for their um, extra interests and time to spend all together as a family because of my husband's work. And another aspect that I didn't really give a, a lot of thought about, we are Christian and we have uh, faith and we believe in creation. And I always tried to find a school that was neutral religiously so I could teach that part to them at home. But now we have the plus of being able to uh, put together our beliefs with what we're learning. And, and that has been very, very special also in history to put together uh, the timeline of events in the scriptures that also go together with history, historical events. And that has been very, very important and great for us. So that's another reason that we're holding on to, to homeschooling. We really enjoy it. Also, uh, being able to give individualized um, teaching. Um, when my eldest daughter started uh, to go to school, it's a bilingual school, and she already know, knew English because uh, she grew up in, in the States when we were at the time that she was growing up. And so English was already a part of, of what she spoke. But 
So it was an easier transition for her into the bilingual school. But for my second daughter, she grew up when we were already in Puerto Rico, so though I tried to get her to speak English, and it was a, a little bit more of a struggle to have it be more natural for her to acquire English too as she learned to speak. And by the time she went to school, um, she kind of thought that English was not her thing. So it was a bit of a struggle in the bilingual school and, and getting her to read in English and speak in English. She had to set in her mind, right? That, that English was not for her. Once we decided to homeschool, she's taken off with being bilingual. And she sometimes speaks more English than Spanish. And she's a wonderful speller, wonderful reader. We've been able to take the time just individually and read together because I've always loved books and tried to teach them to love books. But I noticed once we started to homeschool how little individualized reading time I was getting in with them because we were always in a rush. So that's made a world of a difference. And also we got to know each other on a different level. I used to help them with homework and things like that, but I didn't really look into what method of learning was better for them. And I've had a chance to do that, to see what are their strong points. I mean, I knew their strong points and their weak points because of schoolwork, but I've been able to go more in depth into what works for each of them and what's the better way to teach them. And we've been able to have more fun together because we're less rushed. So I think that fun together, time together, um, extracurricular activities, they're all um, things that families can do, even if they go to school, I have nothing against it. It's just that for us and our schedule and our family time and the distances from where we live, it was getting very difficult to get all those things in. And so homeschooling has been the solution. Um, once they kind of brought me the initial idea that they'd be open to it, I immediately started researching. I immediately started looking up what it would be like if we did that. And, and I soon found out that it was something that we could do. I already had the blessing of being at home. I already loved learning with them. It's just that time, time was an issue and we weren't getting it done to its full potential. So we decided um, actually during half of the year, like I mentioned, it was fall 2005 that I really started researching. And by January 2000, 2006, that was their second semester that year, I decided that there, there was no reason to keep prolonging it. There was no reason to keep taking them to school if we were already um, decided on homeschooling was a, a good path for us. And so I decided to do it in the middle of the year. I did not want to keep taking them to school or keep going on the schedule and the rush that we had in our lives and decided in January to inform the school and in Puerto Rico there's not really much regulation when it comes to homeschooling. I just informed the school and had all my materials ready and all my research done. Didn't have the experience yet, but I thought I was ready. So we took them out. And so January uh, 2000, 2016 is when our homeschooling journey started. And so far we have no plans of looking back. Um, like I said, um, if you have... Uh, good school options where you live and if that works for your family that's wonderful but so far one little bit more than a year in homeschooling has been a really good uh, alternative for our family and time time is everything with family and with learning and and so it's been it's given us time together so these are the reasons why we homeschool and why we keep homeschooling and maybe these reasons will change depending on uh, where we live changes or our circumstances change but so far it's what works for us so those are the reasons why we homeschool or is taking an early morning nap oh no otra vez okay ya 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 voy a empezar otra vez ya 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 voy a empezar otra vez